Namaste and welcome to my channel. So in today's video, I wanted to do this classic holiday look. And honestly, this is probably my go-to look anytime I am not sure what I'm going to be wearing, whether it's Indian or Western. I feel like this look goes with every outfit. It goes with every occasion. And you know, even if you're new with makeup, you can do this look very easily. You can skip the eyeliner and put something in the waterline and put some mascara on, you're good to go. If you want to see how to achieve this look, please keep on watching. Hi guys, welcome to today's video. So I'm going to start off by priming my face and for that I'm going to use this silicone free primer and this is from Good Molecules. I have been testing out this primer for about a week and a half right now and I really really do like it. It does make your makeup last a long time throughout the day and it is very moisturizing as well. Next I'm going to contour my face and for that I'm going to use this Huda Beauty Stand Tour and this is in the shade medium. I love to do this right before I apply my foundation. I feel like it kind of helps me be a little bit more messy. I really do like this trick. I'm also going to take some of it right along my nose as well. And then just using the other side of that brush, I'm going to buff it up. For my concealer today, I'm going to take this Too Faced concealer and this is in the shade Sand. And I'm going to take this right under my eyes and I'm going to also take a little bit of it on my forehead and on my nose as well. And then I'm going to take my beauty blender and blend it out. Then I'm going to take my foundation from Laura Mercier and this is the Radiant Foundation in the shade Suntan. And I'm just going to take a little bit of it on the back of my hand. I'm not even taking a full pump. And I'm going to start applying it right where I didn't apply any coverage so far. And once I'm done doing that, I'm going to start blending the rest of my face with that. Now to set under my eyes, I'm going to take this translucent powder from Too Faced and I'm just going to set right under my eyes with that. I'm actually going to take a little bit of it on my forehead too. Basically going to take this everywhere. I just took my concealer and set my concealer with this. Now I'm just going to take this brush from BH Cosmetics. This is just a fluffy brush. And then I'm going to go into the Ghost Ambient Palette from Hourglass. And I'm going to kind of mix the top three shades together. And then very, very lightly, I'm going to take this all over my face. Next, I'm going to go into my Hula Bronzer from Benefit. And I'm going to take that a little bit over my contour. Same palette, I'm going to go into this blush shade right here. And I'm going to apply that right above my contour and I'm going to take that almost to my brow bone. I love how this blush has a little bit of a sheen. It looks really nice on the skin actually. I'm going to spray my face using this Morphe's Continuous Setting Spray. For my highlighter today, I'm going to take this confetti highlighter and this is from Ciate London. And I'm going to pick some of it up on this Real Techniques brush. And I'm going to take that on the highest points of my cheeks. This is such a pretty highlighter. I always like to take a little bit of my highlighter on the forehead as well. Just above kind of the arch of my eyebrow. And then I'm just going to take my Beauty Blender over my highlighter just to blend it out even more. Now for my eyes, I'm going to go back into this Huda Beauty's Tantor. I'm going to place it on the outer corner, like so. And then I'm also going to take it above my crease as well. And once I feel like I have the shape I wanted, I'm going to take the Beauty Blender and start blending it out. And all I'm really doing it is just pressing the Beauty Blender right where the product is. I'm now moving the product around, just blending it out. And then I'm going to take a smaller brush and I'm going to run that on my lower lash line. And again, I'm going to take my Beauty Blender and just kind of stamp over it. Now I'm gonna go back into that highlighter from Ciate London and I'm just going to pick up some product on my finger and I'm going to press that starting in the center And then once I have most of my product off my finger, I'm going to start blending it upwards. And I'm also going to take it all the way to the outer corner, but I'm barely taking any product there. 
Then I'm going to take some of this on the Sony Kasha brush and I'm going to take that on the inner corner of my eye. Then I'm going to take this liquid eyeliner from Too Faced. I just realized why I don't use that liner anymore. It is so hard to work with. I definitely recommend the Fenty Beauty one. It is so much easier to work with. I'm actually going to go back into this ambient palette and I'm going to pick up the bronzer shade in there. And I'm going to just run that on my lower lash line. For my mascara today, I'm going to take this Tarte's Big Ego Mascara. I'm going to go ahead and fill in my lips using this lip liner from Colourpop. And this is in the shade Bossy. And then to fill in my lips, I'm going to take this liquid lipstick from Dose of Colors. And this is in the shade My Love. Benefits Groove Proof Brow Pencil. And this is in the shade number four. And here's the finished look, you guys. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please don't forget to subscribe. Also, don't forget to hit that notification bell. I want to wish you all a very happy holiday, and I will see you next time. Ciao.